Hey there YouTubers, it's Willie here. I got another how-to video for you today. Today I'm going to show you how to change WordPress's maximum upload file size. Uh, if you've ever had a WordPress blog and tried to upload something larger than 6 megabytes, you might have run into this where it tells you you can't upload anything larger than 6 megabytes. So I'm going to show you how to change the, uh, the maximum file upload size to whatever you want. Alright guys, so all you have to do is create a little text file. You can open text edit or notepad or whatever text ed edit application you have on your computer and open it up and all you got to do is type these two lines of code in. Upload max file size equals and then you can put in whatever you want right here. Uh, 64 megabytes, uh, the M stands for megabytes. Uh, you can do 100 megabytes, whatever you want to do, and then semicolon, and then your uh, max uh, uh, post max size equals, and then your post max size, whatever value you want to put in there, you can put that in there. Um, and then what you want to do is you want to save this uh, as a php.ini file, and you save it. You say yes, I want to save it as an INI. And there you have it. It's right there. Um, the PHP INI file is great, but you have to put it in the right place. And the location it belongs in is the WordPress admin folder. Um, that is the folder at which you're going to put the PHP, um, the PHP.ini file. It's important you do it in the admin folder because it doesn't work if you just put it in the root folder with all the other files. You have to put it in the root directory of the hp-admin folder. So uh, I hope I don't have to show you how to log in into your, uh, your WordPress and do that. But that is where it belongs and um, you just drop it in there. And once you do that, when you go to upload something normally on your website, you, uh, you'll you notice that it won't give you that that um, that error message about it being over 6 megabytes. So good luck. So there you have it, my friends. Uh, it took me forever to figure that out. Uh, I read a bunch of blogs, and I think I pretty much knew how to do it, but I just I couldn't. And the, the main trick is to get it into that admin folder, the WordPress admin folder. Um, but... Good luck getting it to work. If you have any problems, any comments, questions, leave them in the comment section below. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel somewhere up here. And uh, yeah, hit me up. Peace.